Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Abby. I am an intuitive reader and um, we will be doing your monthly love reading for the month of April 2023 Taurus, okay? For the current viewers and subscribers, thank you for supporting the channel and for the new viewers, welcome. Okay, just a disclaimer guys. So um, if it resonates with you, thank you to our guides. Otherwise, since this is collective reading, I will tap into your energy next time. Um, remember that energy shift and change so please feel free to reverse the situation between you and your person Taurus and uh, we will be going to ask your guys about their current energies and thoughts including feelings for you Taurus and their possible next actions advices and plans for you um, for the month of April remember that this reading is in effect from the time you resonate with it upon watching it and it could span across one to six months time this is short-term prediction and i already pre-shuffled the cards and cleansed them as well as the space okay so we will be using different decks for this reading i'm not going to read the reversals we will clarify the cards if we have to and that's how we do it here on the channel so let's begin on your reading taurus this is the prisma vision tarot okay what is your person's current thoughts for you collective Taurus, okay, what is your person's current thoughts for you? Collective Taurus, let's just shuffle them again before we pull your five cards. Their current thoughts for Taurus spirits. Let's take a look. These are their thoughts for you, Taurus. Your person's thoughts about you or about the connection, okay? All right. So let's begin. Your first card, Taurus. Four of Wands, stability and security, commitment. Okay, but we will see. It depends on how the spread here will transpire. Okay, so this is their thing. What they're thinking about to have this, you know, home, this building with you, connecting with you, long-term commitment. Second card you have taurus this six of wands wow so this person here could be traveling okay they could be traveling to see you to be together with you okay because this is um someone riding a boat with the six of wands in front of her okay it's a card of victory and success okay they're so positive about um, about you they're determined to pursue you okay that's as good as it gets here that's how i i sense these two cards as of now third card what are their thoughts you have the ten of wands all right who you have a lot of wands so you could be dealing with a fire sign aries leo and sagittarius coming in strongly here what happened here there was this ending okay okay there was this um situation that's burdensome for them okay we will see it's just a mix of energy here you have the four and the six to be only to be countered by the ten of wands let's see let's see what happened here the knight of chalices Ooh. someone's bringing in love definitely even after an ending of a uh, burden burdensome situation okay for some reason this ten of wands comes in between your four and six of wands and f and the knight of chalices before before the knight of chalices so in between something happened here there was this commitment okay a home situation marriage life um probably living in together commitment and then someone move away from this four of wands okay that's the way i see the cards because they've journeyed to a troublesome water okay they look for some victory or success here they could probably move away from this but only to end up with the ten of wands so whatever they are searching here actually 
It did not come off as a four of wands. Stability and security. It's just chaos. Okay. But they're bringing in this, this cup of love here. This is your knight in shining armor. They're kind of like thinking about it somehow. About this this feelings they have. Now, what is this? Last card, you have the high priestess. So, intuition. This person could be highly intuitive. And um, they have this you know, divine knowledge. They could be very spiritual as well about the connection here. Okay. Now, let's tap into their heart space for now. Okay. So, we could get the whole narrative for you, Taurus, here. Your person's current feelings for Taurus. Collective Taurus. You have the en an ending with this person. It's been so burdensome. Okay. Uh, yeah there could be a divorce or a split or a break up here someone's moving away they think the, the grass is greener on the other side but it did never happened you know so they're bringing in this love for you now let's see for more narrative in their heart space for Taurus collective these are your cards Taurus this is the Romance Angels Oracle Dex by Deck by Dorian Virtue. Taurus, let's see what's your person's feelings for you. Okay. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. They have the ace of chalices here. Bringing in this knight in shining armor more. This Romeo coming in with this love offer or love interest because they feel strongly for you that could probably you are the one they're waiting for. Okay, it's not a cliche. It's coming through here because you have the Knight of Chalices. They have that deep knowing here. Something has ended with their with their life. Okay, it's been burdensome. Yeah, but let's see. Let's see what failed here. What fall apart here in their thoughts in their life. Let go of control issues as a family situation, and you have this Four of Wands. Okay, you could probably have children already allow this situation to unfold naturally okay someone's controlling a domestic situation here or their partner and their children you know yeah so it's asking you to let go of control issues here yeah it, you have this family situation home situation it's divinely guided let let go of control issues you have the four of wands someone move away from that four of wands it could be a separation or you know someone's just um one they don't see victory and success from this this four of wands this is situation with you if it's a family or living in situation whatever the deal is or relationship you could probably living in together so they could probably have you know move away from your home away from you from the live away from the living together or yeah i'm sensing this you are together but someone walk away because they feel so burdensome about that yeah but the love is there it's they know that deep inside but you know this person thinks the control issue is the problem they feel so like you know um controlled manipulated being dictated by what to do or not they don't have that freedom their actions are very limited or calculated you know there are certain things they can do but they have to ask for your approval or if you're interested with this plan or not you know it could um reverse okay reverse the energy here between you and your person taurus now the third card taurus um release your ex the time has come to clear your energy yeah you cannot make this up someone's moving away from that four of wands because there is an ending here it's so toxic already okay it's asking you them they want to release you or you you want to release them okay if it's not happening yet but there will be a time for you guys that you need to probably maybe separate for now okay go separate ways you have the six of wands here move because this comes after your four of wands what's the reason because of the ten of wands so it's releasing releasing the, the this past person okay if you already release them we're talking about your past person here now in their heart space 
very soon clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now okay they, sh they will come back you see how these cards align you have the knight of chalices and very soon they will come back this person you have released or you might come back to them okay but if they come back you have to make sure that are you going to accept them wholeheartedly again give them second chance or another try or not or is, is it really over and done okay between the two of you now you want to come back okay finances and career financial issues are a factor in your love life right now yeah all right is this really what you want because there will be some constraint here control issues also someone manipulating also you will be there will be some problem with your money coming in abundance coming in right now it's there's a blockage here so you decide if you want to come let this person come in or vice versa and you have to deal with other issues also uh, with this person or about yourself with regards to money which you should prioritize love or your goals first making your pentacles growing stability and security because this four of one stability and security could be shaken up that's why there was a separation also money is being a factor of the separation here okay material possessions career abundance okay um it's like there's a scarcity of um of resources right now so yeah clearly decide what you want so if you decide something it will come to you that's whatever that you decide this person even though you have some other issues areas in your life that you need to work on all right now let's dive deep for more intuitive messages for you taurus okay let's dive deep we will be using the um goddess power oracle cards okay let's dive deep about taurus and their person for the month of april 2023 okay let's take a look for taurus let's take a look what's in store for taurus and your person oops sorry guys more intuitive messages for taurus and their person okay All right, these are the cards for Taurus. All right, so this is your first card, Taurus. It says here communion, coming together is in a whole and spiritual way. Okay, communion with someone again. Okay, it's in the horizon and then you have the in between but there is some transition okay on this coming together with your person okay in between your thorn you got your thorn between crossing from where you are now to this new situation with them taurus okay you will be crossing again different situations and now you have rebirth but it's asking you to you know reinvent yourself okay to take good care of yourself it's about second chances to prove yourself and to prove the love to prove the connection to to give this communion another chance okay it's a rebirth of you and the connection okay it's a regeneration of something that's already dead and gone or could probably dying there's survival here there's um a reconnection okay um yeah could also be a rebirth of you rebranding yourself perspective new perspective gain because after this cross or transition here there was a rebirth here that will gonna take place it could be a different you okay now you have liberation freedom wow for some reason i kind of feel like this person you're dealing with actually try to you know hold your neck control you manipulate you that you feel like you're in a cage whenever you are with them that communion with them so you want to cross and transition from that away from that and to rebrand yourself to liberate yourself from that um communion with them you could probably you know moving away literally from this person but we will see 
it's all about loving yourself now devotion and you have devotion here which is loyalty communion and devotion wow these are strong cards okay so what's in store for our lovely taurus when it comes to their connection their love situation between them and their person more intuitive messages for taurus take a look these are your card stores all right let's take a look doors it says here confidence is your key to success okay asking you to be more confident this time about your transition transitioning you're rebranding yourself okay you will be devoted to something for some reason that's coming through and that's the way i sense this cards after the in between here nothing is yet in stone so it's not sure okay just be confident because you know the future is not set in 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 uh um for for when it comes to your relationship okay that's what the advice here okay so don't look ahead and think that this is a fixed situation or this the future is fixed because it is not a new start is coming yeah um if you kind of feel trapped on this communion here with someone or a situation or in this in between we're gonna happen so the this the spirit is asking you to be more patient here because don't lose hope you need to be confident of this transition here the rebirth you will be liberated from that communion and I think you will be devoted at something it, it and this devotion is something to do with your transition it there's you should be committed to make changes that's how i sense the cards now and you need to be confident here and believe that the situation could change nothing is yet set in stone a new start is coming in for you taurus now more intuitive messages your commitment is being tested see yeah that's why it's hard for me to say that you're really moving away from the person because you have devotion you could be devote still devoted at this connection at the situation or devoted at something here but i think this devotion has something to do with the commitment with this communion here in spite of these changes how committed are you to the marriage to the commitment to the relationship okay this is being tested here and lastly intuitive message for you emotions are running high so have to be careful here okay so it could be an emotional stage for the both of you or will be for the upcoming months not only for april so just bear in mind that this commitment that you have with them it requires devotion and because it's being tested you you're asking probably for rebranding yourself for a little bit of freedom and changes okay you need to believe that it could change and a new beginning is coming in for you because um a new start is coming in definitely it could be with you or with you and your person but remember that this this commitment this situation you have this love this relationship is um has been it's being tested um in the waters okay so emotions are running high you could probably be dealing also with cancer scorpio pisces all right i hope that makes sense taurus and um, um if it doesn't resonate with you i will tap into your energy next time i hope you enjoy the reading and i'll see you guys on the next reading okay take care taurus bye bye and peace